Hey guys, what's up? It's Wolf here with Noli, and today I'm going to be just pretty much updating you guys on my account right now. So, so far everything's been going good. Uh, if you guys haven't realized, my team has definitely changed like a lot from the last videos you guys have seen of me. So, right now we finally got mods to S class. We did that last night on stream. If you guys don't like well yeah i'm pretty much making this video just because a lot of you guys probably don't you know like twitch or probably have seen my streams or stuff like that yeah right now we're focusing on getting these two to s class now i'm going to be focusing on dana so dana will be there sooner or later not really sure once it hits on light dungeon i'm probably just gonna farm that like probably twice that she'll get up there or we'll either farm the um, slime, dungeon, slime dungeons that we have now, or either you call them hearts, whichever one you want to go with. I'm going to personally go with slimes, because that's exactly what they are. Um, so, on stream, I did my free summon and got this guy. <laughs> yeah, the one character I hate in the story, but I'm still going to use him, just because he is like a really, really good attacker. Uh, sooner or later, I'm going to put him in a party, but at the moment, I have not. I definitely need to start buffing him up before like we start getting raid dungeons and stuff like that. That's definitely going to be something I need to start getting into. Because um, having a good tacker for like elements would be really nice, so if we get like a light raid, Frey is definitely going to be like really good for it. Um, as for Davi, who you guys see, I got the five star. Davi, I just use mostly for like mob clearing, and she's definitely been helping me out with um, daily dungeons or event dungeon. That's exactly why I got her up to uh, S class and five star. She's just been like a really huge help so far with clearing raids and stuff. If you guys have been to my stream, um, sadly, I don't have duplicate duplicates of her right now. Because I would love to uncap her. So, another thing I would, would like to disclose. If I, just in case I don't remember if I have said it. Did I say uncapping um, increases your level? Because if it doesn't, because if I did, it doesn't. It actually just uncaps your um, skills to where they go up. Just make sure that I did not say that. Just in case it's not true. But yeah, pretty sure all characters they have like level 60 max. I mean, it'll be it'll make no sense if they went up to like 70 and stuff like that, unless there was more stars. But yeah, just to correct myself if I actually said that, uh, let me go ahead and add some friends here. This person's adding me. Okay. Well, if you guys want to add me too, if you guys are looking for more friends, this is my account ID. You guys can add me off that. Uh, sadly, you can't add anybody by typing in their name. You can only find them by actual ID. As you can see. Unless I can actually... Nah. So you actually have that, have the full account ID. So, yeah. Let me grab this stuff out of here. Oh god, we have a lot of things. So far, my account has been coming out along pretty nicely. I've been saving up my crystals for a featured banner like I kind of told you guys you should probably do. So yeah, kind of waiting on that at the moment. Everything's been going pretty well. I've been able to finish a lot of the content. I recently finished uh, normal underground. Been getting my PvP rank up too. The only downfall of my PvP team is if Davi goes down, like, that's kind of it for me. <laughs> um, gotten to the point where I can fill out expiration. Oh, yeah, we got a, another Ju Jupiter for our um, Devil Fiesta, which is unfortunate for us. Because I kind of wanted somebody else other than Jupiter. I wanted another attacker. But since we got afraid, eh, it, it's fine. <laughs> we pretty much got our other attacker. 
Just maxing these guys to use as fodder, just in case I need to get somebody to, um... Six star. It's probably a good thing to max out all of your, um... Three stars. And each three star, like, food you get from, your, like, your summons should be put into the three stars and get them to four star. Then all those four star fodders, you put them into five... Put them into the four stars that you've max leveled and won't use into, you know... Getting them to six stars. Pretty easy, pretty straightforward. Um, I need to set those aspirations back. I normally always put them to a uh, 12 hours and keep one of them for like daily reset. Just so I don't have to wait. And I'll probably forget, like, later on if I don't. So yeah, a bit Dungeons, I'm able to do the max. We did those on stream. Um, I'm not sure about this one, though. Let's try this. Because I remember I did have trouble with the water one. I normally always use these. Uh, let's see. Is there a healer in here? Not really sure. I hate that it only shows up Thanatos. Because I know there's other mobs in there. Oh, if I was just fighting Thanatos, that would be an easy match, but yeah, I'm not. <laughs> Alright. Let's go in and see what's up. Oh, okay, just debuffers. Which can still be an issue. Alright, let's apply heals. Just in case the shields go down. I'm pretty sure defense nor hits past uh, shields too, right? And that's why I like Dami, because she hits like really hard and it nearly kills everybody. Once she's 6 star... I wouldn't doubt she would kill. E what? I tried the ah. I couldn't get it. So I guess him putting up his skill cancelled out my uh mine, unfortunately. So now I'm stuck here with supports. Which is fine. Cause that just means I gotta barrage them. Let's increase our attack. There we go. So yeah, that's, that's exactly why I built Davi up. Just because she can still hit hard either way. So yeah, I can do that pretty fine. Good, 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 good. I haven't done my dailies yet. <laughs> I need to. So let me go ahead and start skilling up. So, let me tell you guys a little thing about Raid just to prepare you guys for it. Because it's actually pretty important. Um, so, if it is anything like the Creed version, you guys are definitely going to need to save crystals just to get to the next stages of rewards. So, it's pretty much like, if I remember correctly, on the first stage, you get it for free. It's basically like, the first page like for, for rewards is just like, oh hey, we'll give it to you for free. But then it turns into, hey, the second page, we'll, we'll give it to you for free. Then the third page, it's just like, oh, hold up, dude. You're asking for too much. You're going to have to start spending crystals for the rest of these rewards. It kind of enters that. And when this raid comes out, you probably want to have as many friends as you guys can. Because the more friends you have, and the more friends that are pretty much active doing these events, is probably best. I need to check for inactives also. Okay, so it doesn't change anything, so I have to go all the way down. Uh, I need to start removing inactives just because they won't help me in, like, any raids at all. 
especially if I have any and I could okay I hate that we go to the top after removing someone because the more friends you have the better like the better chances you have of completing an event let's say that because the more friends you have, the more raids that are going to come your way because your friends are going to be sharing the ones that they couldn't finish off or defeat. Finishing the boss gives you um, a lot more. So if you are the finisher, you get a lot of rewards. But if you do like a good portion of damage, you will still get decent rewards. Uh, there's a certain threshold I cannot remember for like um, boss raids. Just trying to remember. But who is, who's ever first place also gets a lot of rewards too. Those who are in second or last, eh, not so much, but still. You want to prepare yourself, get yourself um, ready for whenever raids come in. We don't really know when that's going to start, but I'm pretty sure it'll probably start around like probably a week or two, if anything, at best. So start getting yourselves you know, powered up, get yourself a good attacker, DPS, get support, stuff like that. Uh, most of the time they do have like up to, well, you, you're not going in with just like five characters, I'm sure, if I remember. I remember if you go up, go in like at least 20 or so. And these raids actually give really good XP also for like fighting. So you can level up a lot of good units like pretty decently fast with the more attacks you do. Um, I'm not sure if it's relying on, yeah, I don't think raids rely on stamina that I know of, but any, if any Korean or Japanese players know that, uh, do correct me and that actually helps me out too. Cause then I'll know. I'm trying to remember if there's anything else about raids that I need to talk about. If anything, like I said, if a Japanese or Korean player know anything else about raids, or know the full thing on it of how it goes let me know put it in the comments and help us all out that would be fantastic so as for my completions and everything um we are now on chapter five yeah I, i've been working a little bit slow since i've actually read the story because the story is actually really interesting i think chapter six is the last one um, it seems equipment is going to be on chapter 6. So the max one for XP is chapter 4, if I want to farm. Huh, interesting. But the further in the story you go, the better XP you get anyway. What else? <laughs> I don't know, I just paused for a second. But yeah, we beat uh, normal, so now we can do hard but I'm not sure if I could complete that considering that it's doubled of what my power is and we're going to be fighting 50s but I'm probably still going to try it and see if I can beat it because you know worst case scenario I'll just have to wait until tomorrow just to finish it As for Devil Rumble, everything's pretty much going pretty well right now. Pretty much getting up a good rank. I'm in bronze right now. Uh, where is the rankings and stuff? Lee rewards. I think that's it. So I'm in bronze, heading on to silver sooner or later. Because I haven't been really attacking all that much. I've just been casually, you know, climbing up the ranks. I do need to get this milestone done. So let's do that. See if we can beat the mystery team here. I'm sorry that this video is all over the place. It's just that this is really awkward because I didn't prepare. <laughs> um, change is going to be so bad to go up against right now. Just because Dana's going to be popping shield after shield. And that's going to cause a hassle. Davi's getting poisoned also. That's not good for us. Like I said, if Davi goes down, then we're pretty much screwed. Ah, uh, we're good. 
Perfect. Get rid of that shield. Alright, we killed one person. Uh, okay, good. Didn't hit who I, <laughs> who I wanted to live. Oh, crit. That's exactly why I like Davi, because she also rate God damn it, she I always try to pull up the shield, but it always drops down halfway. But the main reason I like Davi is just because she harasses the team a lot. I probably should have waited that shield. But she'll heal like a lot. Ah, unless we get stunned. Oh, they all missed her. What the hell? But she's probably gonna die before then. No? Alright. We killed the main issues. But this is where the troubles of stuff starts. We're gonna go in fever soon, so that's good. So we're going to go ahead and revive just to have the upper hand. Or not. That works too. Get rid of that shield of yours. Boom. There we go. <laughs> That's why I like Mod. Just because she can revive. I'm so happy I got her. That helps me out so much. So did we actually finish our uh, milestone? Or do we have one more? Ah, we have one more. Alright, let's fight this guy. See how it goes. So there's quite a bit of characters that are actually pretty decent. Most of the five, most of the four stars are actually like really good. But what I know, Mona is actually really good to uh, build too. Come on, crit, crit, crit. Ah, oh, there we go. Oh, and it dropped. That's another thing I hate. My crit goes away when I when I'm about to use it, man. Feels bad, dude. And like that. Every time. Damn, I might have to slow down my gameplay then. Just go to times one speed. Actually, that would probably be, like, best. Wait, did my shield just expired on that? You piece of crap. How dare you. Okay. So can I get a crit so I can, uh, tap? Please? Ah. Okay, there we go. So, yeah, I recently got Pantheon, like, a few... Oh, actually... Yeah, a few days ago. And Duna Arena is like super, super beneficial to everyone just because they give so much crystals. Even inside of um, Ruby rank, they gave me around like 200, well no, 2,000 to like uh, 1,000 to 2,000 pretty much. Which is like really nice. So if I was to say do Arena, Hell yeah, do Arena. Arena gives, like, really good rewards. If you haven't been doing Arena, it's probably best to do it now. But at least to try to... At least try to beat the weaker people that you are pretty close to. I could definitely say that. Oh, it's you. Okay. If you guys are wondering why I didn't change Mott's uh, costume... Not a huge fan... Eh. So I just stick with this one because it's a lot better. If it was on Scissor Dead, it would probably look a lot better. But I'm gonna wait for a skin or something. Probably, it'll probably make it like a lot more sick. But yeah, at the moment we're just going through a little bit of changes. Finished all these rewards like pretty quickly. Um, on pretty much step seven, I had everything completed. I didn't have to go back and do anything. Pretty nice. Uh, we got some equipment that was 
decent. I only kept getting freaking five star armor instead of five star weapons, which really kind of bums me out. And we got darts. I, like I said before, I don't use anything that only has like one stat on it. Normally I use like these with two stats. Mostly just because there, there's so many other weapons that are more beneficial than just one stats. I don't know if it like, well, if anybody knows if the stats like increase like way more, that'd be interesting. Now let's, let's try that. Let's see how far you go up. Versus like everything else. We're not by 30. Now I just need to see. I'll just come back to the video if I ever find like a four star um, gear. See how much that goes up for. Because maybe it's like, is a lot better. Who knows? Or maybe it's just based on, um. oh, well. I was going to say maybe it's just based on each other. Like being different ranks or something. But yeah, I don't know. <laughs> like I said, I'm still relearning the game because I haven't played it in like so long. Yeah, most of the stuff came back naturally to me, but not everything. So yeah, we still got a lot of progress to go through, especially in the story. We got, well yeah, we've been pretty much going through story inside of a uh, stream. Been saving up a lot of crystals. I cannot wait for that banner. We still have a lot of stamina just because of the freaking <laughs> devil fiesta. And uh, what else? Oh, and our story rewards too that we get from this, I think? Okay, no, it was Mona's dungeon. Or Mona's missions. Yeah, you get a pretty decent amount of stamina just to keep going through the story. And a decent amount of crystals as well for complete, fully completing it and doing like certain areas. So, yeah, looking forward to a lot of things. But with that said, guys, I'm gonna end it there. Hope you guys enjoyed the little bit of pretty much update on my account and will join me on stream now and then so yeah well today well tonight as in this video going up we're gonna be doing some epic seven just because i haven't streamed it in a while and we have a moonlight summon coming up so yeah until then peace out